What's up guys, it's me again, Flo or Wes, however you want to call me and I am so happy to be back with a special topic today. It has been a long time ago when I posted my last video and it was a big struggle for me to record now this video again, it uh, took me a long time but now here I am and today I want to use i want to use this chance this opportunity to talk about a special topic i think it's a special topic for me but for the whole industry or music industry at all i want to talk about the death of avicii and what we can learn from the death death of avicii and yeah what this can teach us in general stay tuned <laughs> Welcome back on my channel guys, it's so good to be back and I'm so happy that you are watching this video right now. Thank you a lot. Uh, first of all, I want to thank you all that you supported me and asked me questions on Instagram, whatever. Of course, I followed my my progress, my, my development on YouTube the last three months and it's amazing guys. I don't know what to say. Um, I remember a video where I, I think it was like five days ago after my birthday in August and then I talk about that I almost reached 400 subscribers and now I'm heading to 800 it's totally amazing so thank you so much guys it means a lot to me now I try to keep going with my videos but yeah like I said life is un unpredictable this is why I have chosen this topic today for my video I don't have a script for this video today but um, it was kind of important for me to talk about this topic because we can learn so much about this death. To talk about death is for some people really hard, but we have to face it. I mean, death is what we all fear. Maybe some people are aware of it and some people aren't. But I mean, it's really important to be aware that we we live for 80 years or longer or whatever, but we will die. Definitely, we will die. And it's so important to talk about this topic. It's not usual to talk about it, but we have to. So maybe it's a little bit different today. It's not that kind of DJ tutorial today, but I really want to talk about this. So let me start with this. You see that the background here right now. Um, this is the, the tribute, 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 I think it's tribute. Um, show a concert for Avicii, Avicii's death. And I watched not the whole uh, concert, but a part of it. When I watched it, I, I felt, yeah, I was really emotional. I, f I was really impacted by this whole thing. What Avicii, has no not has but achieved for his life in his life is amazing so let me start with this um, quote from Avicii when I die I want to be remembered for the life I live not the money I make and I think this statement alone is so powerful and reflects Avicii's life completely what can we learn from Avicii's death? What can we learn from it? What does it say about life? And how can we change our life? Yeah, sure. I mean, Avicii is dead, and that's the I can I think the greatest fear ever we all face in our life. And on the other hand, I remembered I'm still alive, and I'm on this earth and have the opportunity to to spread my message or to to go out and inspire people we have a great impact on other people we can create a big impact on people i mean in the negative way but also in positive way and i have chosen the positive way differently so maybe you're gonna ask yourself what does it mean to my um, to my life or what does it mean i mean for me it means a lot i mean um, Avicii's death 
it's important for us all because I mean we all strive we're all striving for success for fame and um, acceptance and money or whatever but this is all external you know and this is the same for Avicii he gained a lot he achieved a lot over the time but he didn't care about this all he only cared about his music and that he inspired people and we have to be aware of ourselves of our body and we have to courageous enough to go after our dreams even if there are people they say no you will never achieve it or you're not good enough to be that kind of star or that producer or that rapper i don't know what you want to ever be we have to be wise enough to listen to ourselves and to our bodies and all the external things like money relationships social fame whatever it doesn't count really all the answers that you need all the questions you have you can answer it by yourself if you ask the right question to yourself if we are strong enough and aware enough to listen to our body and ourselves, we will find our right path to achieve whatever we want but we have to keep that in mind time is not unlimited so whatever you have whatever your dream you have just go for it and don't let let you let you down by other people because they are too scared of their own dreams whatever your dreams you have maybe it's to become a great dj or just to produce the, uh, music or whatever it is please write down your, in the comments what your dreams are i'm really interested curious about this topic and want to listen to your dreams you have and of course i want to go in touch with you um, and listen to your stories you have or the stories or the, the situation you already experienced so that's the video for today guys thank you so much for watching again and i really appreciate it all i can say is just follow your dreams but listen carefully to your body and to your feelings and of course to your gut thank you so much guy don't forget to hit the subscribe button and of course if you like this video just give me a like and whatever you want to do reach me out on instagram and yeah hopefully we see us in the next video see you next time live a life you want to live bye